what to do when breastfeeding becomes really painful. Now, I'm sitting here with Lucy from LucyLouMotherNurture.com. She's a doula and she knows all that there is to know about birthing. So I'm so glad you're sitting here because now we're going to be talking about breastfeeding and, and, and the pain yes. um, that some mothers experience. Yes. So yes. how can we get through this time? Yeah, good question. So I think um, for a start, breastfeeding for a very natural process, it can actually feel very unnatural right. for a lot of women and a lot of women express challenges. Breastfeeding shouldn't be painful, but there are some challenges that you might need to navigate to make sure that um, breastfeeding is comfortable. So we need to get to the bottom of what is actually happening, where the discomfort is coming from, and right. that might mean hiring a postnatal doula to help right. you out. It might mean getting some advice from a lactation counsellor or a consultant. Okay. But I really encourage mums to seek the best information they can yeah. so that they can get baby back on the breast and feel comfortable and confident. I think it's so important what you said, which is it's not supposed to be painful, mm. but it can be a difficult process. Mm. So seek that help. Get Absolutely. help if you need it. Absolutely. Don't be shy to ask. Yeah. I think all, almost all um, issues in regards to breastfeeding can come down to a poor attachment. So just, just some quick tips, making sure that you as the mum, if this is you I'm talking to, who's breastfeeding right now, well done. Keeping shoulders relaxed, right. sitting back on the couch, but with a cushion behind your back to support you. Making sure that you're holding baby's back of its head and the top of its neck with an open palm, and then very gently guiding baby to the breast. You can bait the baby's mouth by touching the um, baby's um, nose with your nipple to open the mouth wide. And then once you've got that beautiful open wide mouth, that's when you want to Right. encourage baby onto the breast. Right. But keeping shoulders down is really key because as soon as you raise your shoulders, your nipples actually come up as well and that's not good for breastfeeding. Right. Yeah. At a certain stage, you're... <laughs> yeah. You're not too old, and then yeah. oh, they might just stay in a certain Well, position. that's true, but we won't tell you about that. <laughs> that's for later in life, right? Absolutely. Um, and I think also really important to surround yourself for, with really encouraging people. So, um, grandmothers, lean in. Um, this is your role, best friend. Um, you can be a really good support to your breastfeeding friend and family member by just encouraging them to keep going and give it their best. Yeah. And at the end of the day, Fiona, I think that if breath breastfeeding is not working yeah. for mum or for baby, and there can be some reasons why that is the case, nourishment of your baby in form of nutrients and love is what baby needs. Right. So um, if that means feeding baby by bottle, that needs yeah. to be okay as well. Yeah. Thank you so much, Lucy. Pleasure. I hope that's helped you. Keep it locked right here at Mums at the Table. And don't forget to click here for more of these tips and so much other more topics.